all right guys on today's video i'm going to be showing you um how you update uh to the latest version of the homebrew channel now when you use the hack me installer um the latest version is going to be 1.1.2 so this is actually going to be the most recent uh, release the 1.1.4 uh, keep in mind this is only going to work for um, the Wii version 4.3 so this works for any region I'm going to be leaving you a link in the pinned comment to my page where you can get all the files that you're going to need so here's all the files you're going to have the apps folder with Wiimaw Lite to install the um, homebrew channel wad and then you're going to have a wad folder which is going to have the uh, wad. Um, this is basically um, all you're going to need to make the update. Um, now we're going to get on the Wii. Um, and I'll show you um, how to set everything up. Alright, so now we're on the Wii. Uh, first we're going to go into the homebrew channel. And I'll show you uh, what version we're on. So go to the homebrew channel. Start it up. Uh, when you hit the home button, it's going to give you all the information. So this is uh, version 1.1.2. Uh, this is what, what you're going to get uh, once you use the Hack Me installer to um, hack your Wii. And this is the iOS 58, which will stay the same. So let's exit the system menu. Uh, so we're going to install the WAD using Wiimod Lite. So just uh, load up Wiimod Lite. Go down to the WAD manager, press A. Um, if you're using the SD card, just press A on the Wii SD slot. Go down to the homebrew channel, uh, WAD, press A. Press A again to install. Should be pretty quick. There you go, it's been installed. Now press A to continue. Press B. And then press home. Now it should take you back to the homebrew um, or the main menu. Um, as you can see, uh, you, you're going to have two homebrew channels. So we're going to have to delete the um, older version. So to do that, go over to the Wii options. Go over to data management. Uh, channels. And then usually um, the latest app that you're going to install is going to be the first one so this homebrew channel is most likely the older version um, so just press a on this just go to erase yes there you go now go back go back Back again. And now you're left with one homebrew channel. Now we're going to start it up to see if it's the right one. Now we'll press the uh, home button to see the version. So there you go. It's been updated to version 1.1.4 and the iOS 58. Uh, now this basically updates everything it makes everything run smoother and it has more support for all your apps so um, That is how you update the um, homebrew channel um, I always suggest updating any app to the latest version uh, sometimes it might uh, 
have something new that you're gonna need uh, so I highly recommend it whenever there's updates to apps or emulators to do so so um, I will leave the link to my uh, page in the uh, pinned comment where you're gonna find the download uh, I hope you enjoy the video please like comment and subscribe and on to the next one